Hey guys, welcome back to Angel Angela. And on this topic, you guys, we are talking about the narcissist chess game. The narcissist chess game. So, um, if you guys don't know about chess, um, chess is a game that takes time. It takes time because every move you make you have to make sure it's your best move. You have to protect your king. You have to protect your queen. You are a king. You are a queen. You have narcissists surrounding you. Narcissists want to attack everything about you. Narcissists want to interrogate you. Narcissists want to um slander you narcissist want to make you look like the villain they want to put words in your mouth they want to mix what you say to fit their agenda um and a lot of times um we don't understand that when you're dealing with a narcissist you literally have to live in a world where it's like you see no evil, you speak no evil, you hear no evil. Because the narcissist is looking for a reaction. They're looking to have a smirk on their face or a smirk on their eyes, a deep glaze, beady eyes. That's what they're looking for. They're looking for for you to speak of evil. They're looking for you to hear them say something that's a lie and they want you to repeat it again or repeat it to the wrong person. See, the narcissist plays life like a chess game. Every move you make, you have to be careful. Now, let me tell you what your your power is your power is your words, the words you choose. If you go to work, to your job, for example, and you're going about your day with your different coworkers, you have a coworker talking to you about their problems, maybe they want you to start talking about your personal problems to make you feel as if you can relate. You're not knowing this person's a narcissist. This person is feeding you lies. This person's this person wants to use what you say against you. It's a chess game. Anytime you're speaking to a narcissist, it's a chess game. They want information. They want to know everything about you. They want to know if you're spiritually awake or are you are you sleepwalking they want to know these things they want to figure you out the thing about narcissists is that when you speak they are trying to get you to say something negative um, and they want to twist what you say. So in any conversation you have with a narcissist, it is a chess game. You might think that the people around you, your friends, your coworkers, um, you know, your partner, um, wouldn't do these things to you. You would hope they wouldn't. Or you might even ask or wonder why they would do these things to you. And the reason being is because they are at war with themselves and they are at war with you. They don't know who they are. You figured them out. You know who you are. They see your light and they are paying attention to every word you say. That's why it's better to sometimes... Just silence yourself and speak positivity. 
Um, that's all narcissists want you to do is speak negatively, very negative about yourself, um, speak very negative about other people. Um, they'll speak negative of other people just to watch your reaction to see what kind of person you are. Are you going to go along with whatever they're saying? Because if you're going to laugh at their jokes and go along with whatever they're saying, they're watching. They're always watching you. They're always paying attention to you. Um, so my advice um, for you guys is that when you go out into the world every single day is to watch your words. Never speak negatively about other people because that's what the narcissist thrives on. They they thrive off negative vibrations. So when you go out in the world, um, watch your vibration there's going to be people that are going to come out of nowhere trying to ruin your day, trying to make you feel less than, trying to tell you who you are, trying to tell you what you are not, trying to put you down, trying to belittle you. Um, and in those moments, you have to realize that you are at war spiritually and that words are more powerful than what you think. They create reality. Don't let other people create your reality on who you are. So stand firm. Fight this battle back and fight it back with silence. Don't let these people anger you. The narcissist doesn't care about positive, negative reaction. They love it when you get upset, angry, sad, when you're crying, when you're mad. So narcissists will always find a way to make you say something negative. That's all they thrive off is negativity, attention. And by knowing this, you have to make sure that every move you make, it's, it's your best move. You have to. Your life depends on it. Don't overlook anything. Don't overlook not even the smallest conversations with people. The smallest conversations that you think just don't have major meaning take it serious even if you you might think this person is a nobody or this person is whatever you you might have whatever perception you, you have of these people don't don't underestimate them these people are all connected to each other and know each other or will find a way to connect to each other so you have to make sure that everything you speak of is positive so um i'll talk to you guys on the next video and i hope that this video was helpful sending you guys lots and lots of love light peace and guidance in your journey talk to you guys on the next one bye